So uh, from there, I think we're going to have a pretty good show there, John. I think so. What do you say we get into the Chamber of Commerce business report for tonight, visiting with Bob Haberman and Campus Movers? Campus Movers is located uh, on Alameda Drive, which is in the Progress uh, Drive Industrial Park area. Uh, as I indicated earlier, we're going to take a look at their warehouse, and uh, if you listen closely, Bob is also going to be able to uh, talk about some insurance uh, ideas that you should keep in mind when you're moving. And the idea is that you should keep your household valuables insured to prevent loss or damage during the moving process. So uh, without anything further to say about uh, the Chamber of Commerce business report, let's go now and visit with Bob Haberman. For most of us, a move can be a monumental task, but for campus Mayflower movers, this is, happens to be an everyday occurrence. I have with me Bob Haberman, who is one of the owners of campus Mayflower movers. Thanks for talking with us, Bob. Thank you, Dad. I wanted to say to our audience that campus Mayflower movers is located at 12312 Alameda Drive, and that's in the Indu uh, Progress Industrial Parkway. Uh, Bob, could you tell us a little bit about campus movers? Uh, when did you and your brother come in on the scene? Yeah, we came over in uh, 1975. We bought the company. It was located in Berea at the time. Mm -hmm. That's why it was called Campus Movers, because of Baldwin Wallace College there. And uh, we built it up. It was a smaller company at the time. And uh, we built it up, and then we moved out here in Strongsville in 78, on July, July 4, 78. We came out here. Okay. Uh, could you tell us a little bit of how you arrive at your prices for the uh, uh, moves? Well, long distance moving, it's uh, fairly simple. It's weight total weight of your household belongings and the mileage distance to we move to, whether you move to Chicago or to Los Angeles. Uh, the farther you move, the more expensive it's going to be. And the more, the more weight you're moving? The more weight you're moving also, correct. And um, the uh, truck is, goes to the weight scale, weighs the truck before we put your household belongings on, go to your house, load everything up, go back to the scale, and whatever the difference is, is your actual weight of your goods. Mm -hmm. And then the driver comes back, we compute the charges, and depending you know, how far you move, depends on the price. Mm -hmm. Can anyone ever get uh, a set moving price, a set, uh, a set f or a flat fee? Yes, yes. Right now we have uh, our moving consultant can go out to your home, look at everything there, see what the, construct the weight, weight on, the, uh, on the cube that he, she has, and uh, gives you a flat price. It'll be the price. From door to door? Door to door. No charges at all at destination, whether you've got an elevator there or flight charges there or anything else. It will give you the price of flight price, and that's it, all the way across. What about when a whole family has to get transferred from one place to another? How do you go about moving them? Well, we, we go in there. Like Also, we give them the estimate, and then we do the whole thing, packing, loading, delivery, the whole thing. Same people, one crew does the whole thing for you. But, uh, you work with the same people all the time. That's the main thing, is that you, you get to know the person, you know, and he does a good job for you that way, too. And I imagine that puts the family at ease, because uh, a move can be a, a traumatic effect for a family. Uh, those, are, those are my personal possessions you're moving, so you want to make sure someone handles them with oh, care. That's right, and they're all trained with us here. And uh, it's, we don't, you hear sometimes stories, people get picked off the street to help load or, or, or deliver or something. We don't do anything like that. It's uh, the same crew. We have a driver, a co-driver and they go and they do the job for you. And, it's, they, and they're, we train them here ourselves. They're all brought up a little bit. They become helpers, the third man on the job, and go out, get to learn the local work and everything. We start them out on driving, and then uh, they move all the way up and they buy their own truck sometimes. And then they work for us that way. Very good. Uh, what about moving businesses, offices? Uh, how do you handle that? Oh, we do that quite a bit. Uh, office work, it's, uh, it's it has to go pretty smoothly and fast because it's uh, the time the time involved. Uh, once again, the consultant goes out, sees how many boxes we need. We send the boxes out. Normally, the office personnel pack up their own boxes. Sometimes we do it. And we have to bring a lot of these four-wheel rollers in. We have about uh, 80, 100 of those, depending on the size of the office. And uh, move them all out. Have ramps set down on every level of the, ho of the office. Most offices, you know, it'll go fairly smoothly Very with the work. Uh, these office moves, do they have to be handled during working hours? No, uh, many times office work handles after 6 o'clock or after 5, whenever the office is closed. That way they can go on with their regular office work and uh, the job can be finished and then we'll come in at night and do the do the work for them. Very good. You have a beautiful brick building here and it's a large building. Uh, I, I'm assuming you do a lot of storage here. Quite a bit, quite a bit of storage, uh, permanent storage, temporary storage. Uh, and anything that the customer needs you just you know contact us and we'll work something out with you we've had stuff here for over a couple of years 
people just keep letting it go. Okay. Uh, you have different kinds of storage, maybe. I, I, I understand you, you store vehicles as well as household goods. Could you tell us a little bit more about that? Yeah, this winter we had uh, three vehicles were in here for storage. A mobile home was here for storage. We had a 25-foot uh, boat was here. Uh, you know, it's inside. People like it because it's safe. They have the uh, heated, no rain, anything right. like that. Right. That's unusual. I don't think most people realize that uh, a moving company would go ahead and store vehicles. And uh, as you said, you've got fire safety, uh, you've got heat and even temperature. Right. So that's interesting. It's also good for the uh, household goods. Right. It's, uh, this is one of the largest warehouses in uh, Northeast Ohio, 40,000 square feet. Mm -hmm. So it's gonna, we're going to keep a, do a good uh, safe storage. Uh, tell us a little bit maybe about the insurance. People are putting all of their valuable possessions here. They want to know a little bit about your, uh, the kinds of insurance that you have. All right. We've got uh, over a year ago now, we received the uh, full value protection coverage now, and it's uh, replacement coverage. Now, that, do that does not mean uh, any depreciation on there, no right? depreciation at all. Uh, if an item is un irreparable or if an item is missing, we will replace that item for you. We reimburse you for that total cost. Right. No matter how old it is. No matter how old it is. Very good. Uh, dates. Can a family rely on the fact that you say we're going to be there at such and such a date? Oh, yes. Uh, we have guaranteed pickup and we have a guaranteed delivery date also. We'll guarantee the date you want. You want it on the 23rd, it'll be there on the 23rd. We guarantee it. Very good. Uh, what about estimates? Can we call for estimates? Anytime. Just call. We'll set up an appointment, whether it's evening or morning, whatever suits the customer, and there's no charge for the estimate. Okay. And the, uh, they can call you at uh, 238-0333, and that's Campus Movers, located at 12312 Alameda Drive in the Progress Industrial Parkway. Thank you very much, Bob. Thank you, Danny. This week we're going to continue with our dental series with Dr. Frank Casella. And as John had said earlier, Dr. Casella is going to be talking to us about more enjoyable dentistry.